I'm interested in how images are being read, interpreted, and understand. Um, um, I think in part because uh, how it was wise, widely used during the Vietnam War. Um, uh, the Vietnam War was the most documented uh, war. Uh, and uh, that's also how the world see Vietnam. Weaving create a kind of complexity and layer and texture that uh, we don't get from a flat image. Uh, and I think that physicality re is really important for me. And also the pixelation, the breaking up of the images into fragments and how they form together, how they coming together to create something else. I like the idea of challenging photography as a two-dimensional medium and his woven photographs really take that on in terms of reappropriating what is a photograph, changing the idea of what it means and, and bringing it into a different environment. How we, what we remember of Vietnam and that for, for people of my generation, I mean, it's something that we grew up with. Over time, you forget what is fact, when in reality it's a hybrid of information, what we remember, what persists. Weaving them together literally as well as figuratively is what's happening in our minds. And I think Din's work is very strong in that area and really picking that out. And I think that's really the kernel. You have this amazing temples complex. Even today, you know, they still uh, bring awe to all those who visit them. On the other hand, you have these very famous portraits of the people that were imprisoned, uh, tortured, and photographed, and then killed by the Khmer Rouge. So I'm kind of interested in these two extremes, what we are capable of. The idea of monuments and memorials and how the two very similar but completely different at the same time. To undermine the monuments and turn them into memorials was kind of like the overall uh, goal. Working at CPI definitely introduced me to a whole new way of, of printing an image and uh, material you can print on. It really connect well with my sensibility with, with paper and uh, the idea of making it uh, tactile and in a way three-dimensional. I've been uh, wonderful. I feel spoiled <laughs> uh, because I think the staff here, the artists, they understand very quickly what I want to do. The audience here in Singapore, maybe they will share that experience that I have, this conflicting experiences. Visiting Cambodia, you know, you go from one end to another, and you you asking yourself, how could this exist in one this place, and yet something so the opposite end also exists in the same place, and how do we grapple with this conflict that we have?
think those are the questions that I want to raise and how we come to term with this contradictory feelings that we have.